Thank you for joining Wars of the Roses as we continue with part 30, The Poor Indian, from book the second, The Practice of the Mystic Tie by Albert G. Mackey. Part 30, The Poor Indian, a correspondence of the Cincinnati Masonic Review, relates an interesting incident of the benevolent tendency of Freemasonry, which occurred in one of the western states. One bright but bitter winter evening in November, after the ordinary business of Lodge had been dispatched in peace and harmony, a brother rose and presented the case of a stranger in distress, an Indian and a Mason, who, with his family, had recently arrived in the city. He had received a letter from him detailing his destitute condition and informing him that he had eaten his last morsel of bread with his wife and children and knew not where to look for a further supply. The letter closed with an appeal which would have reached any benevolent heart, but in an especial manner was calculated to thrill the heart of every brother of the mystic tie. An appropriation was promptly made and a true and trusty brother selected to hasten to the relief of the poor Indian. He was found in a rude quarter, emaciated by sickness, surrounded by his tattered children and in utter destitution. His wife, the faithful partner of his bosom, was absent, seeking, if possible, from the cold hand of public charity, a penance to supply their immediate pressing wants. A sprightly-looking little girl, about ten years of age, was standing by a younger brother, who clung to her as the stranger entered and communicated to his afflicted brother. The scene was one of intense feeling, and the worthy brother, who had been the agent of the lodge in dispensing its aid to the destitute stranger, expressed its affection upon him by saying, shortly after the visit, had I never before known anything of the Masonic fraternity or its benevolent actions, this one act would have been sufficient to convince me of its value and wed my heart more strongly to an institution so benevolent in its nature. Thank you for watching and please don't forget to share, like, subscribe, and comment. And if you can, please consider donating to Wars of the Roses. Links to PayPal and Patreon are in the description. Thank you so very much.